Where are my fucking chuggers at? I'm kind of scared. I'm kind of scared. We'll see what happens. Here. At this point, I'm, I'm starting to like lose it here. Where am I going? This is where shit's gonna get crazy. What the fuck? I have in my hands, there's a sixth one here, but I have in my hands six beers. Uh, we're gonna try to drink all of them during this run. <laughs> here's, here's the plan. So this is the drunken 120, uh, no reset. My plan here is to drink one beer in every homeworld, or every homeworld. And there are six in this game, so I'm gonna drink one on the Nestor cutscene, and then drink one for after every balloonist, during every balloonist cutscene. And hopefully I can chug the whole thing during the cutscene. Just the instant alcohol fucking hit. I'm gonna be drunk by the end of this, and I'm gonna probably regret doing this. By the way, I don't recommend doing this. This is not a healthy thing to do. But I'm just gonna fucking go for it because I think it'd be a pretty funny thing. <laughs> Where are my fucking chuggers at? I'm kind of scared. I'm kind of scared. We'll see what happens. Trippy Spiral, thanks for the gift. Here we go. The drunken 120%, no reset. Three, two, one, go. Chuggers in the fucking chat. Still got like half left. All right, beer number one down. We are gonna finally put the question to the test. Does alcohol hurt your speed skills? I have a feeling the answer is yes. Every time, okay, so here's the first like effect of alcohol that I wanna share with you guys. So. Every time I look over a chat, it's like obviously kind of a distraction, right, from the speedrun. So I have to get good at like looking over a chat at the right moment and then looking back really quickly and being able to get my head right back into the game. Um, now, now that I'm, we're having like a conversation here, I'm like starting to have trouble with that balance of like, I look at chat for like too long and I was like, oh wait, what, what, what am I doing in the game? I'm starting to have those sorts of ex moments now. Ooh, with the gold split! The drunken gold! <laughs> you gotta respect it. Nine, this is a good pace right now. As it stands right now, I'm still trying to get a good run. Like, I, I would love to get like an actually like decent run by the end of this. 124 or better would be like a fucking humongous success. But, we have arrived at beer number two of the run. Here comes the first balloonist. Here we go. Cheers. Oh Lord. Yeah, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be an interesting run. <laughs> I'm already very, very buzzed at this point. Oh, all right, let's go. They're fucking like turning out in front of people and shit. Oh my God, okay. Come on. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I, I, let's say, I think that's the first drunken mistake of the run. I literally just pressed the X button too late. <laughs> Reaction time's going down. <laughs> I don't think it's affecting my gameplay too badly, but at this point it is affecting my mentality. Like what I was telling you guys about, like I'm not so hardcore about the PB grind mentality like I was in the first home world. But besides that, like I think my autopilot is still like pretty, is still in good condition. All right, viewer number three, here we go. 2616, cheers. <laughs> All right, I gotta drink the rest of that when I enter Alpine. We're officially three beers deep on this run, and I'm not even halfway through the game yet. For reference, when you guys watch me play like casual games after stream, this is the amount of alcohol I probably would have drinking by the end of the night. It's about this much. This is where I like to stop for the day usually. At this point, I'm starting to feel like, oh, like, like, I know there's gonna be a hangover tomorrow, you know, so I gotta really drink water. So I'm not doing that bad, all things considered. I'm still 122 pace. I did miss the thief there. Let's see if we can get this supercharge. This is where shit's gonna get crazy! What the fuck? Dude, I'm not ready to supercharge right now. Okay, okay, we got this, we got this. First big mistake of the run. 
Dude, these, like, just the normal movement is going by really quickly for me right now. So the supercharge is just something I'm just not ready for. Oh my god, fuck. <sighs> okay, okay, we made it, we made it. Oh my god. And the next two levels have crazy supercharged strats in them, so... <sighs> now, now the game is getting away from me. Alright, here comes the fucking supercharge. Pray for me, please. I missed him? How did I miss? What? I went right through him. I f I'm, I, that's not even me being drunk. That's the game fucking being a bitch right there. What the fuck was that? How did I miss him? I, I clearly charged through him. Did you guys see that? What the fuck was that? You know it looked like it's like, oh, well, you like I basically him did bike game there. I don't know what the fuck went wrong. What's the difference between playing the game high versus drunk? So for me, weed um, makes me feel like I can focus really hard for like 10 minutes. And then it's like really, I'm like really into it, you know, for that time. But um, first of all, if I make mistakes during that 10 minutes, it's harder to recover. I, I lose rec strength and recovery because I get, I get uh, flustered more easily. So yeah, so I get like flustered really easily when I'm stoned and then after those first like 10 to 20 minutes of like that initial like but similar how I'm talking about like with the uh, the initial buzz of the alcohol is starting to wear off and now I'm just like settling into the drunk. Um, it's almost like the same thing with weed where like the first 10, 20 minutes you're like, oh, okay, I'm stoned, you know, it's like a change in, in mental state. But... Um, but then afterwards, you're just tired. I just get tired. And it's, I'm sure it's going to be the same way with, with, uh, with the alcohol as well. I'm just going to be tired by the end of this run, you know? I'll just be probably over it. Yeah, I would say at this point, at this point, I am now legitimately, like, if you were to, like, say, like, yo, buzzed versus drunk, at this point, I am drunk. I'm having, my, there's, like, significant motor, uh, function issues happening here. Okay, next beer. Oh, my God. I'm not even ready for this. Beer number four. Cheers. Your facial expressions are funny. My facial expressions are funny. I'm trying so hard to keep it together right now. I am four beers deep on this run. And all at this point, I'm just trying to keep it together. I'm starting to have 3D spatial awareness issues. Like the way the cleanup of the end of the level there is actually kind of specific the way you have to like um, get the red gems at the end. And um, sort of overwhelmed me. I'm starting to get overwhelmed by some of the uh, 3D spatial sort of spacing lines and things like that. Missed. I missed the red gold dead. I didn't miss the red. I'm a fucking idiot. I thought I missed that red for sure. Who else thought I missed that red? I can't be the only one. Yeah, at this point, my, I'm starting to like lose it here. Okay. I'm trying to focus. <laughs> I'm trying to, like I said, I'm trying to focus. I don't know why that glow. I definitely pressed X there. I'm gonna blame the controller for that. What even is the zone? How did I live that? Are you kidding me? How did that work? I was convinced that was not gonna work. I'm a fucking god, dude. As far as actual movement tech execution, like jumping and stairs and charge jumping and flame charging goes, I'm still doing that all at a very high level. In fact, dare I say I'm doing that at a higher level than I normally would be on a PB pace. I mean, this isn't PB pace. That's pro that probably has part part of the thing to do with it. But I do think it also has something to do with like the the lowered inhibition from the bajillion beers I drank. Okay, beer number five incoming here. Here we go. Cheers. It's so funny, I'm like playing this run as if I'm on like world record pace. That's what it feels like. That's how hard I'm trying right now. I'm like two and a half minutes behind or something. Is that everything? Okay, we're good. Let's roll. Three, pardon me, three and a half minutes behind. 
One life. Can I get the fucking wall glide? Oh! Big gamer moment right there. Not an easy wall glide. I dare any of you guys to try that. Let's go sexy man bow wow 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 wow. <laughs> Bro, for you, I'm about to go for the flop right here. Next. Ah, you saw what I was going for. You saw it. I just saved a minute there, dude. Fucking pog champ. Just kidding. It's it's the wrong route. I'm Next. still a minute. I'm still like three minutes behind. Next. Oh my god! Perfect execution, by the way. I need you guys to pray for me. This is probably one, at this point the run gets very hard. This is the hardest part of the run from here to the end. I'm gonna go for this. I don't give a shit. No, fuck you. No, not you. Never mind. Come on. There we go. That's per that first try, by the way. Fuck you. I'm a world record holder. I feel like I'm watching this run like I've never seen it before. I feel like I I'm seeing some shit like. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know when you've never seen a speedrun in your life? I'm sure a lot of you guys are, like, relatively new to speedrunning, right? I feel like how you feel right now. I'm like, what the fuck is this guy doing? Like, how is he getting through the game? That's what I feel like about myself. How did that miss? I b fucking blame Obama. Watch this. Oh my god! How am I... M okay. Watch this. What the... What the fuck? I had that. Nope. No, I, I tried too hard. I was too, I was trying too hard. You could tell I was try hard. I suck so much dick, it's ridiculous. It's actually ridiculous how much cock is in my mouth. If I just at least sub 130 this, I'm a god. <sighs> I don't even want to drink this. Cheers. <laughs>